my name is Reggie Koba. I am the son of Dennis Henry Koba, and he was the he was the son of Reggie Koba. So I'm Reggie Junior, and Reggie, my grandfather, is the son of Henry, and the guy that started making the moves. <laughs> my great grandfather, um, Henry Koba. Uh, he started a, a, a club, a sports club. It's called Lily White. So basically, Lily White had netball, soccer, rugby. They were trying to empower black people to play sports. Reggie was known for his business mind. He was business minded. So the guy, he invested in a lot of things. His first major thing that he bought was Mm, the family house in in Albany Road, in the colored area, 51 Albany Road. So my father, uh, Dennis Goba, he was uh, a guerrilla in Mkonto Oasis. So he was, he was known to be notorious within the Mkonto Oasis ranks. He wasn't a high rank, but he was one of the soldiers. And often my cousins will always tell me about how he got locked up for days and in jail because of his his political uh, things. And I'm like, okay, my father was a fighter. He did something. Okay, yeah. During 2016, um, during our reference list and, and the fees must fall, it became relevant that I'm a son of uh, 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 one of the war heroes, Zem Kontoisizu. Like, I got inspired to say that my father did this once against uh, against the oppression, oppression, and now we have the same, not the same, but we also have a kind of oppression within this system that they fought for. So being there was like, I'm just continuing the legacy. The dark part is um, like, the expectations that come with the legacy. You know when you don't live up to the expectations, people look at you badly. The next Gobas that are coming, they must create their own legacy. <laughs> <laughs>